Hi everyone, Liz here, thanks for stopping by. So I've got an unbagging to do today and this one has come to me from the good people at fgnormal.com um, They asked me if I would like some uh, items to show on my channel. I said, yes, of course. Um, I have had a few from them before and they've been really nice products. So yeah, always happy to receive a few more to have a go with. Okay, see what we've got. Oh, we've got one happy spring. Oh, very nice. Not quite spring yet, we're still in winter, but uh, we're getting there. And oh, that one feels like quite a big heavy one. And then, oh, we've got a special drill project. Yay, it wouldn't be a Liz unbagging without a special drill. So let's have a look at this one first. Uh, we are in January 23 and it is smashing the specials at the moment. So smashing the specials five. Um, I think I've taken part in the last three. I think there's only the first one that I missed because I do like doing my specials. So let's have a look and see what we got this time. So it's organised by uh, Mindy and Brandy. I'll put their links down below and the uh, links for smashing the specials if you do want to take part. It's just a bit of fun. There's quite a few prizes and things as well but I like it because it just means I get to see uh, all the different uh, canvases and everything and all the different things that people do and uh, yeah it's nice to share okay so we've got a nice little toolkit pen boat and wax we've got oh special drills oh and we've got a hot pink yay that's a good start to the new year a hot pink okay so we've got a little stand so it's a wooden one which is really good it's not it's like ply board these not quite sure if there's a different uh, name for it but there's quite a few layers all uh, sort of squashed together to make up one larger piece but I do prefer these because they tend not to be as breakable as uh, like the acrylic and things and it is you can probably tell look at the shape look at the shape and it's Mindy so it's an ohm <laughs> look at that one is that not just cute or oh, what we are coming up to well, we're January now and a few weeks time it will be Valentine's Day. So if you celebrate Valentine's Day, February the 14th, then yeah, I just thought he's quite a cheeky little chappy. Um, I did have a little Valentine's corner last year, so I will be having it again this year. And yeah, he's uh, again wooden, nice. And I like the main thing I like about these is the fact that the, um, the like keys the letters and everything are on the top of the canvas. They're not on the bottom. When you get the acrylic, sometimes uh, they put the letters and uh, the keys on the bottom of the acrylic. And then you get a, a funny view, a skewed view of actually doing them. Whereas when they're actually wooden, because it's not see-through, they have to put it on the top. So I like those best. But yeah, and it just stands in his little platform there. Look, so once he's done... Um, yeah, he's definitely yeah, looking at his, his feminine side, isn't he? Because he's a pink gnome. Yay! <laughs> oh, I think that's lovely. The expressions, it just really makes me laugh. I, I didn't like gnomes. I've never particularly liked gnomes until I started diamond painting. And it was Mindy showing them all the time. And I thought, oh, well, yeah, that is quite cute. That is quite cute. And then, yeah, I'm I'm really into them now. I just and they are everywhere. Christmas decorations, so there's loads of them. They seem to be breeding. <laughs> I've been taken over by gnomes. Okay, right. So let's have a look at these. So there's only what we got. Two, three, four, five different gems and colours, but they are very, very pretty. Okay, so we've got our lovely hot pink. We've got to have a red because it's Valentine's Day, so I'm thinking that's maybe the heart. Ooh, oh, part of the, oh no, it's his um, little gloves and the bobbles on his hat and his little shoes are red. Oh, it's, it's a pink heart. And then a pink, and then we've got this lovely uh, coated white. It's got an iridescent coating on. So it just gives you that little bit of extra sparkle. And then a little teeny tiny bit of orange. So where does the orange go then? Oh, he's got an orange nose. <laughs> a little bit sometimes orange nose. Uh, yeah, that's a bit of a fake tan, I think, if it's gone orange. <laughs> so 
is really sweet but i just thought oh yeah that's really fun I like that let's give him a quick measure uh, and the price of him on the website at the moment is five pounds and 50 sorry and 33 pence that's in the english money so it's about 19 and a half 20 centimeters which is roughly seven and three quarter inches and then the little width is uh, 11 centimeters which is about four and a half inches and your little stand just give this a quick measure uh, for about four and three quarter inches uh, which is 12 centimeters oops but uh, let's have a look let's have a look uh eight sorry six centimeters but uh which is about two just between two and a half two and a th three quarter inches so nice little size he'll just uh, say go in my little display for valentine's day oh got a couple that i did last year uh, that were acrylic so i shall get those out and they can stand with them oh you could even put uh, somebody's name on it or somebody's initial you've got some spare gems you can soon uh, just add a little initial or a couple of initials into the middle of that i do believe that actually says love though looking at it now i can't remember when i ordered it but yeah i think there is an l o v yes there is there are slightly different colors on those gems there in the middle so it does actually say love oh but you've still got a little bit of space down there that you could put an initial in Hmm, okay, so that's our first one. So if you go on to FG Normal, um, they have got some special offers on shipping at the moment and there are other special offers on as well. So if you go and check on, there's like little different things that come up um, telling you all about the special offers and what you need to spend for where you live and everything. So go and check out the website, fgnormal.com. So thank you for that one. We love that one. What shall we look at next? Let's look at the middle size one next, which says Happy Spring. And I believe this could be a special grill project. So we could even go in smashing the specials as well. I'm getting a nice collection. I don't know about getting any of my older ones done, but I'm certainly uh, starting on my newer ones. <laughs> I do like to do all the new ones as well. Not enough hours in a day. Oh, this is a nice soft canvas. This is going to flatten down really easily. So, oh, been sent the bit of rubbish look. <laughs> Just a little tag. Uh, we've got a pen, butt and wax there. We've got, oh, nice sparkly special drills in there. Oh, and a few different ones. Okay. And it is, oh, it's another gnome. <laughs> So my thinking with this one was, um, he, he's sort of like, he's got a red background. Well, he's red with his lady beds and everything. Um, so he can go up with my um, Valentine, he said Halloween then. He can go up with my Valentine's items, but then he can also stay up and go in my spring display. So I am trying to do different displays each time and keep swapping out my pictures. Uh, so that I can see them all because I've got so many now and I do love them all and I just don't have enough wall space so I think if I just do keep changing them all out and then uh, I can see my different ones but is that not just cute wow oh it's really lovely and look he's sniffing the flower and it's just got a little tiny ladybird just on the top there I don't know if you can try not to get any glare yeah there you are you can just see look just above the middle of that flower there is just a little ladybird. So he's sniffing it and the ladybird's there. <laughs> We've got another ladybird here, one up there, and then a bit bigger one up there. Oh, I don't know about happy spring. I just think this is a happy painting. And he's got little bows in his beard, look. <laughs> oh, it's wonderful. I just think the character and the expression on these come out so much when you think all you've got is a nose. There's no eyes or mouth for the expression, but just with the nose, you, you just really get that feeling of what they're thinking and what they're, they're uh, looking at. Oh, it's brilliant. And I love the outside of this. They're like scalloped border. And then it's actually a slightly sort of darker colour than white. 
so you can see your definite lines for cutting round. And then this scallop has got little drills going all the way around the edges and then just little flowers and leaves going round. Wow, oh, I love this. That's really, really pretty. Oh, this is going to be uh, on my next one to do as well. Yay! Actually, I would say I wasn't really looking forward to doing smashing specials in uh, January because I thought I've done so many in December. But now I'm getting all these and I'm just loving them so much. I'm thinking, yeah, I'm glad it is because I've got an excuse to do them. <laughs> so this one is 16 different gems and colours. Uh, I'll give it a quick measure. It's 30 by 40, but I think we'll find it's 25 by 35. Yep, 25 that way, which is a nine and three quarter inches by oops 35 that way which is 13 and three quarter inches so yeah it's a standard size we've got our little thumbnail there as well oh look at that oh i just love it the flowers and everything right let's have a look at these drills sparkle sparkle Okay, so let's start. Ooh, we've got all sorts in here. All right, so we have some lovely, very sparkly silver there to get started with. And a nice yellowy gold. Your standard black. Oh, a couple of greens, look. So we'll get quite a bit of turn on there because we've got two greens to offset each other. And oh, a lovely red. That's going to be the hat and the ladybirds. I think lovely. Nice cherry sort of red and a very pale yellow and a pale blue and a nice goldy colour. And then our specials, oh, look at that, like an amber colour, large amber colour round. And they're what I call owl claws because the first time I saw them, they were all owl claws pictures that I was doing. But uh, yeah, they're very good for flowers as well, they're like a, a teardrop uh, that are in orange with an iridescent coating on. Some larger round blacks. Oh, and look at these. We've got two sizes of like your yellow, gold, uh, very elongated marquees. So, yeah, I've had those before, but I don't know whether I've had them in that size. So, ooh. And then some nice little marquees in the like green with the iridescent coating on. And then just some more green there, slightly larger without an iridescent coating on. So, I'm thinking that they're going to be the leaves that are going all the way around the picture so that's really going to offset it very very pretty oh I like those please i got this one i do like my specials let me know in the comments do you like doing specials or do you prefer your full drill i tend to find that i prefer my specials when i'm doing specials and then i prefer my full drill when i'm doing full drill <laughs> i'm just awkward <laughs> Uh, and the price of that one at the moment on the website is £4.99. Okay, so let's have a look at the next one. Um, this is a 40 by 40, so we've got a larger full drill painting. Let's have a look. Okay, so let me just move that one out of the way. A nice square painting again quite a nice softish canvas so it will flatten out quite nicely oh lots of drills right but uh, yeah you will get quite a few with it being um a full drill and with it being 40 by 40 you same toolkit again but you've got a bit of extra wax because it's a, a full drill and it's a larger picture and it is january okay uh, lots of uh, white on this one and quite a lot of colour blocking if you like to put more than one drill down at once and use your uh, drill tips your pen tips that actually have the, uh, the little extras on that you can do I think from 1 up to 12 13 I think now you can get possibly even more I don't know if I've seen a 15 or not if you can pick up that many drills okay so it is January and I just thought, right, if I'm doing 
my corners then I can maybe do a January corner whether I will actually get this one done in January although we are still at the beginning so I might do if I can get it kitted up in time uh yeah so it's 20 different gems and colors and all DMC codes on it as well and they're all nice the keys uh, and the symbols are all nice large capital letters and we've got Oh, we've got a D and an O, but they're different colours. The R and the B, oh, R and B, uh, are similar colours, but I think they're going to be clear enough that there's not going to be a problem with that. And, uh, yeah, I tend to get P and R muddled up sometimes, and they're a definite different colour. But that is a very, very clear drill field. You can see those, all those letters and symbols on there. Really good. So what I would probably do with this one, which I do a lot when I get something that's got a massive background that's all one colour, is probably just do all of the white first and then do all the nice bits, the colouring in bits, as I call it, last. <laughs> get the boring white out of the way. But sometimes I find that um, I, say I, I am a single place. So I've not really got into multi-placing, putting more than one drill down at once. Um, and I do tend to find that sometimes if you just don't really want to concentrate, then just filling in all one colour, just lines and lines of all one colour can be quite therapeutic. Um, yeah, so I do sometimes like to just sit and do that. So that's why I liked this one. So we've got a huge hot, uh, well, it says hot cocoa, uh, hot chocolate. It's got marshmallows in it as well. Look, you see a little bit of steam coming off it there. And we've either got a spoon in it or it's going to be one of those melty things. You know, you can buy all those different spoons. There's loads around at Christmas um, where you like have a little thing, a little pod or a little spoon with something on or a little round circle and you put it in and it melts and it's got all different bits and pieces that then float onto your hot chocolates. Lots and lots of different ones. Um, oh, I got a, a vodka chocolate one. Uh, for Christmas and that was really really nice as well didn't last very long <laughs> but yeah that was uh, quite nice and warming because it was very cold just before Christmas and then during Christmas and since Christmas it's been quite warm so yeah we didn't get our snow this year but never mind but there's always a good excuse to have a hot chocolate so yeah that's really a nice picture and it will definitely go up on the wall once I've got it done uh, as long as it's still January, I don't think I'll have it up past January. Um, right, so it's 13 and three quarter inches, which is 35 centimetres. Just check, it's probably exactly the same the other way, but we'll check. Yeah, 35 centimetres, which is your, oops, 13 and three quarter inches. Okay, very good. Let's have a look at these drills. There is a lot of them. Lots of different colours as well. I'm never going to be able to get it back in this packet like this. Okay, so let's start at number one. Oh, look at all the whites. Wow. So they've even put those separately. So it's 3865. So it's your sort of winter off-white colour. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight different packets of your white. Wow. Okay, I bet there's a lot left over. Um, you know, they, they always tend to be really, really generous with drills. And uh, yeah, there'll be quite a few left over, I'm sure. Okay, so we've got like this lovely rosy pinky colour and a couple of greys there. And then like these are the mocha colours. Okay, and then we've got a nice aqua blue and a purpley colour there and another little bit of blue. And like a russety colour and a burgundy colour. And then we've got another blue there and a very green, like a jadey green. And a nice paler blue and another sort of rosy red colour. Another couple of blues and that's like a very dark grey. Another turquoisey colour and then a very dark jadey green colour. So quite a muted colour palette other than the white. Um, yeah, more greens and russets. And just that little tiny bit of purple for highlighting. So, yeah, very, very nice. 
So it looks like nice quality. The drills look good, but we need to get them on the canvas to double check. Oh, look, and these are actually going back in this packet. Wow, I've actually got them in the packet the right way around as well. That never happens. <laughs> Okay, so we have a three canvases. Well, we, we have two canvases and our lovely little note. So we've got our great hot chocolate, great for January. We've got our happy spring because we want spring to come on the way. And then we've got our little note <laughs> for Valentine's. So actually we've done January is hot chocolate, nice cold month. Then we've got uh, February with our little Valentine's gnome. And then we've got March, which 21st of March is uh, the first day of spring. So yeah, we've covered three months in one little package. <laughs> okay, well, a huge thank you, FG Normal, for sending me these. I really do appreciate it. And I love them. I think that's my favourite. I just love that. just think it's such a happy picture. And uh, yeah, I love the ladybirds. I just think that's excellent okay well i hope you've enjoyed looking at these with me if you have a thumbs up is always much appreciated any comments or questions in the comments down below and if you would like to come back and see what i get up to next and see some of these completed then if you press that subscribe button and the all notifications bell next to it you'll be notified when any of my videos come out so you're not gonna miss anything yay okay thank you ever so much for stopping by don't forget to check out fgnormal.com and i hope to see you all again soon bye for now